Sister wives Janelle Brown slams Cody and Robbins, poor parenting. And Janelle Brown back in Flagstaff after purchasing land in NC, why? I will explain everything. Watch this video until end. Hey lovely viewers. Welcome to my update gossip channel. Sister wives star. Janelle Brown slammed her ex-husband and former sister wife, Cody and Robin Brown's, poor parenting. She and former third wife. Christine Brown Woolley have taken exception for the way he favored Robin's kids. Yet, during the Sunday September 29th episode, Janelle saw improper parenting and had no problem calling it out. Once Cody Brown married wife number four, Robin Brown in 2010, everything changed. She brought with her three children from her previous marriage. They then went on to have two more kids, Solomon and Ariella whom Cody seemed to favor. As the years went on, Cody claimed that Robin and her five kids were the most obedient and loyal of all of the family. More so, he was not the most attentive father to his other 13 children, especially during the pandemic. Cody alleged that since Janelle Brown and Christine Brown Woolley were not following his strict pandemic protocols, their children were being just as lax. He stopped spending time at their homes, which Christine maintained had happened before the pandemic and the kids did not feel connected to their dad. In the early days of the show, Cody appeared to give all of his kids equal love, time, and attention. On the Sunday September 30th episode of Sister Wives, Cody noted how he would try to go see the OG3 and their kids. However, Ariella would not allow it, holding onto his leg. Ariella was melting down. She grabs my leg and won't let me leave. And I'm like, Robin I need you to drag her off me. And she says, she's expressing herself. You're gonna have to take five minutes and let her do it. She's just dragging along my leg screaming, Don't leave me, daddy. Don't. Leave me. And I'm like, golly, man, this is hard. Robin would tell Cody that he had to stay with her and calm her down whereas she alleged that she knew the importance of him being with his other families. Furthermore, Cody stated he could not be away from Ariella and Solomon longer than three or four days. Per E. News, Janelle Brown doubled down on that and noted that her children dealt with the rotation and long separations just fine. My kids from the very beginning knew that. Their dad was not going to always be there. I always felt like Cody and Robin mismanaged the situation with their children. He couldn't be away for more than three or four days because Ari just gets so sad or whatever. I feel like that was poor parenting. Through all history of the family, the other kids did it and they're fine. They're well-adjusted adults. It has long been Robin Brown's way or the highway. This prompted Cody Brown's wives to exit the family based on how much. He favored her. Janelle Brown further added that the children never felt comfortable at her home despite allegations that Robin was the one who felt shut out. With Robin there was always a very separateness. My children were always scolded if they opened up Robin's fridge. Christine Brown Woolley, who has since remarried, shared this about how her six children felt about Robin. My kids didn't like going over there because they saw that Robin and their dad were a couple and he wasn't in our home. So they were frustrated. For many years, the Brown kids shared one home which was divided up into three areas for each wife which Cody would split his time. Then, Robin came in and changed the whole dynamic and nothing has been the same ever since. It was recently revealed that Janelle Brown purchased land in North Carolina and is embarking on a new passion project with her daughter, Maddie Brush. However, Sister Wives fans have uncovered that Janelle is back in Flagstaff for the time being. Will she be moving to North Carolina? A Sister Wives fan took to Reddit to discuss Janelle's whereabouts over the weekend. They acknowledged that she just bought property for Taita Farms, but claimed to have seen Janelle Brown walking down the street in Flagstaff. Many people believe that Janelle would be moving to North Carolina now that she had property there. Her grandchildren and daughter live there. Not to mention, she just announced her passion project, Taita Farms. The Instagram page for Taita indicates that it is a flower farm. According to the property's website, the mission of Taita Farms is to build beauty from the ground up, transforming our land into a sanctuary where every bloom and every leaf tells a story. Beyond just being venue, Janelle and her daughter envision Taita Farms to be a haven for community, where people gather to reconnect with nature and each other. 
We strive to create an enchanting space that fosters joy, love, and lasting memories, ensuring that every visit to our farm is a celebration of life's most beautiful moments, the site reads. With so much to get done on the new land, many people are wondering what Janelle Brown is doing in Flagstaff again. Of course, fans have some theories. Is Janelle actually moving to North Carolina? First, it has not been confirmed whether Janelle will spend full-time in North Carolina or not. Plus, Maddie Brush, her daughter, and business partner in this venture, just announced that she is having baby number four. That said, there is still a lot for the sister wives star to do before she can leave Flagstaff in her rearview mirror. She needs help moving her RV to North Carolina. This is something that her late son Garrison used to help with, so she will need time to find someone willing to transport her home cross-country. On top of that, Janelle Brown is in the middle of selling Garrison's home. There are other factors at play too. They haven't sold Coyote Pass yet, and Janelle has a significant stake in the land. While there still isn't any news on what will happen with the land, it is possible Janelle is waiting to see how that plays out as well. All of this is just speculation though. Janelle has not actually confirmed that she will move to NC full-time. In fact, it is possible she will still have to travel to Arizona occasionally to do business with her MLM. The current Sister Wives storyline is significantly behind what's going on now though. As several fans have pointed out, in the most recent episodes, Janelle and Maddie have been looking at farmland in Montana. However, Everyone already knows they wind up buying an NC. Other plot points are dreadfully behind the present too, but it has still been interesting to see how each of the wives is dealing with the family breaking apart. Sister Wives star Cody Brown admitted that he considered skipping oldest son Logan Brown's wedding to Michelle Petty in October 2022 due to the rift in the family. I don't want to be there with people looking at me but not talking to me. I spoke with the bride and groom at one point I said, I think maybe I better not come, the Brown family patriarch, 55, said during the Sunday September 29th episode of the TLC series. The reason I suggested I shouldn't go is just all the hate that I'm getting from family members. Mostly just all the talk from Christine and Janelle. Though, Cody and the rest of the cast did not reveal whose wedding they were attending, fans figured out that they were discussing Logan's nuptials due to the timing of season 19 filming in 2022. TV cameras did not capture Logan, 30, and Michelle, 31, tying the knot, but Logan's mom, Janelle Brown, shared photos from the wedding on social media. Her followers noticed that she was wearing the same plum-colored dress from her son's wedding day in a self-recorded confessional during Sunday night's episode, further hinting that the family was talking about Logan's big day. Cody revealed that he and wife Robin Brown did attend the wedding after all, but they were seated separately from exes Janelle, 55, and Christine Brown. Robin and I were put over kind of in a corner, probably for our safety, he said. It was just in the back. The Brown family entertainment founder continued, I saw Christine there as well but I didn't talk to her. I did feel like some people were trying to look like they were having more fun than me. This is how childish this whole divorce has been. Janelle acknowledged that it was just so weird, to stay away from Cody, after 30 years, of marriage. Cody's ex-wife Mary Brown also opened up about her experience. Being at the wedding was a little bit awkward just because there are some people in the family that don't really want to interact with me, she said. I'm kind of in the middle of this breakup, it's just kind of weird. But at the same time, there's definitely people who are okay with me being in their presence, and those are the people that I hang out with. Christine, 52, was the first to announce her split from Cody in November 2021. After more than 25 years together, Cody and I have grown apart and I have made the difficult decision to leave, she wrote in a statement on Instagram at the time. We will continue to be a strong presence in each other's lives as we parent our beautiful children and support our wonderful family. At this time, we ask for your grace and kindness as we navigate through this stage within our family. Christine and Cody share kids Aspen, McKelty, Peden, Gwendolyn, Isabel and Truly. An insider exclusively told In Touch in December 2022 that Janelle and Cody had separated. Janelle is a strong independent woman and realized she can do it on her own, the source said, 
adding that the reality star outgrew her husband. In addition to Logan, Janelle and Cody share kids Madison, Hunter, Gabriel, Savannah and late son Garrison. Cody and Mary, 52, who share child Leon Brown, confirmed their split in January 2023. In light of a recent unapproved press release, we feel compelled to share our own truth, in our own way and in our own timing, they wrote on Instagram. After more than a decade of working on our relationship in our own unique ways, we have made the decision to permanently terminate our marriage relationship. Sister, wife star Mary Brown is done with Cody Brown and his tantrums. Though she has moved on in her life, she still doesn't leave any chance of taking a dig at the latter. The celeb recently shaded her ex-husband and dropped many jaws. Mary shocked everyone by cracking the spearmint gum joke. While Mary was merely joking, fans were able to read between the lines and caught her sarcasm. That could be the reason why they called it the shade of all time. What is this all about? Did Mary really shade Cody on social media? Sister Wives viewers have watched Cody Brown demeaning Mary uncountable times. He stopped treating her as his life decades ago and had a platonic relationship. Moreover, the celeb even admitted to the cameras that he didn't know what to do with Mary while the latter was begging to reconcile with him. But that's not all. Cody crossed all his limits during season 19. He claimed that divorce wasn't something that sucked, but marrying the wrong person did. Cody directly said that Mary was the wrong person, and he evidently regretted it. The latter was shattered with such revelations, yet she decided to deal with dynamics with utmost grace. However, it appears that the lone wolf has had enough, and she isn't ready to let Cody go without getting the taste of his medicine. Sister Wives Mary Brown takes her revenge from Cody with spearmint gum. Sister Wives star Mary Brown took a not-so-subtle jab at her ex-husband, Cody. Brown, and fans aren't able to get enough of it. She shared a clip on Instagram in which she dramatically tossed out a pack of spearmint gum in the dustbin. The celeb sarcastically wrote in the caption, Don't ya know I don't like spearmint. Viewers were quick to note that this was a direct reference to Cody's complaint in one of the recent episodes. Cody accused Mary of having some sort of baggage and recalled how he once offered her gum. He mimicked the latter and said, You know I don't like spearmint. Apparently, the celeb trolled the lone wolf for not taking spearmint flavor gum that he offered to her during their initial days of marriage. This evidently didn't sit well with Mary, so she decided to clap back at Cody. Mary didn't hesitate to shade Cody publicly. She proudly announced that with or without her ex-husband, she doesn't prefer to have spearmint gum. The celeb threw the gum and made it clear that her choices wouldn't change because of Cody and wouldn't change her personality for him. Moreover, Mary added the hashtag, worthy UP, and her viewers now know that she has leveled up her game. Fans felt that this was the best shade ever, and they couldn't get over the way Mary had shown Cody his place. It's common knowledge now that the Brown family is not what it used to be. Sister Wives viewers have seen them for a decade, but they fell apart a few seasons ago. Before that, most of Cody Brown's kids had become adults, and started families of their own. They stopped appearing on the reality TV show and one of them was Madison and Caleb Brush. The former has been Cody and Janelle's eldest daughter. In fact, her wedding was also a major part of the show. While she stopped appearing in the show as much, she continued to move forward with her husband, Caleb Brush. Well, celebrations are in order for Maddie and Caleb as they recently announced their fourth pregnancy, while Sister Wives fans have seen Cody, Robin, Janelle, Mary, and Christine take center stage of the show, their kids rarely appear on it, especially the ones who are married and have families of their own. Viewers have a special corner for Janelle's elder daughter, Maddie, as they consider her family very wholesome and away from the drama. But Maddie and her husband Caleb are achieving milestones after milestones in their personal lives. They recently announced a passion project with Janelle Brown. They are ready to grow their flower farm together in North Carolina i.e. to Ada Farms. But that's not the only thing that's worth celebrating in their lives lately. Here's what else is going on. Robin, Janelle, Mary, and Christine take center stage of the show. Their kids rarely appear on it, especially the ones who are married and have families of their own. 
Viewers have a special corner for Janelle's elder daughter, Maddie, as they consider her family very wholesome and away from the drama. But Maddie and her husband Caleb are achieving milestones after milestones in their personal lives. They recently announced a passion project with Janelle Brown. They are ready to grow their flower farm together in North Carolina i.e. to Ada Farms. But that's not the only thing that's worth celebrating in their lives lately. Here's what else is going on. Sister Wives Maddie Brush pregnant with baby number 4. As mentioned above, Sister Wives fans love getting a glimpse of Maddie and Caleb's family. They have made it a thing to refrain from drama and fill their social media space with adorable updates about their home life and kids. While everyone was already getting excited about their floral farm venture with Janelle Brown, they made another announcement. Madison took to her social media to share a wholesome picture. She was hugging her pregnant belly in it by revealing it for the first time. Brush called 2024 a wild year, perhaps referring to her business venture with her mother. She mentioned that the next year, i.e., 2025, will equally be crazy as her and Caleb's fourth baby will arrive then. That's not all. Maddie adorably called her unborn child, baby brush hash four inches and said that they have a due date for the month of match next year. So, it was a shocking reveal for the sister wives viewers. None of them had suspected a thing before it. So, they have been very excited for the couple. They can see things are looking up for the family. Not only do Caleb and Maddie have new business to look forward to, but they will also welcome yet another bundle of joy. While their plates seem a bit too full, but Janelle and the rest of the plural family's involvement will help the couple through it all. Sister Wives has captivated audiences for years with its family feud. The Brown clan never lacked drama, and their issues entertained viewers. But it appears that their endless emotional roller coasters have benefited their bank accounts as they receive a hefty amount for their family drama. Fans were in shock when they recently learned about the cast members' million dollar salaries. Well, the Og Browns are earning way more than you think and are richer way beyond your imagination. What is this all about? How much are they earning? The Brown family has many other paychecks coming into their bank accounts besides the sister wives show. The head of the family, Cody Brown, has a gun business, and he evidently makes a great amount from it. The celeb further makes cameos for his audience and charges for making exclusive videos. Then comes Robin Brown, who has an online outlet, The Sister Wife's Closet, where she sells jewelry. On the other hand, Christine, Janelle, and Mary have their own businesses. The former has her Airbnb while she works for Plexus. Janelle has started her flower venture, Tenda Farms, and she is also part of Plexus. Then comes Mary Brown, who has her Lizzie Heritage and Worthy Up businesses. Hence, these three women have evidently created a great career and are working hard for their living. But there is a lot more that's coming to their accounts because of their appearance on Sister Wives. Sister Wives cast members are receiving million dollar salaries. Christine, Janelle, Mary, Cody, and Robin have been part of the Sister Wives show for decades and their bank accounts are reflecting their stardom. Sarah Fraser of the Sarah Fraser Show recently talked about the paychecks that these five are receiving and fans weren't able to believe their eyes. She revealed that the Og Browns are getting $40,000 per episode in season 19. Apparently, this amount would include all kinds of one-on-one -on -one tell-all postseason episodes as well as any other kind of specials, spin-offs in the noted season. Moreover, it appears that season 19 will be great in terms of money because it has some extra episodes. Usually, editions have 13 episodes. But this one contains 24 episodes. So, if we multiply $40,000 by 24, we get the jaw-dropping figure of $960,000. Yes, this is the amount that every Og cast member is getting for season 19. Hence, Cody, Janelle, Mary, Christine, and Robin are earning nearly $1 million from season 19, and their drama is evidently paying them a lot. Apparently, this $1 million doesn't include all the payments that the Browns are getting from their side hustles. These are mainly the result of their appearances on the reality TV show. Hence, their stardom is surely paying them off well, and fans love their drama. With the highly anticipated premiere of Sister Wives Season 19, Co-star Peden Brown revealed that he started working at a racy new job. 
26-year-old Pete and is Cody Brown's son with his third wife, Christine Brown, who left Cody in the plural marriage in 2021. When the beloved unscripted series premiered in 2010, Peden was only 11 years old, so he practically grew up on television. Though he was close to his father while growing up, Peden and Cody have grown apart over the years, and they are currently in a full-blown feud. The Sister Wives season 19 co-star may be hopelessly estranged from his father, but he continues to enjoy a close relationship with his mother and his siblings. During the second episode of the new season, Peden informed the family that he had started a new job, and the racy location was certainly unexpected for a nice Mormon like him. Christine may be estranged from Cody and Robin's side of the family, but she's very close to her children. After leaving her polygamist husband during Sister Wives season 18, she met and married David Woolley, with whom she shares a blissfully monogamous relationship. During the second episode of Sister Wives season 19, Christine had a small family reunion dinner with her children and grandchildren, and Peden dropped quite an unexpected bombshell on the family. During Christine's Sister Wives season 19 family dinner, Peden shocked his mother and siblings by announcing that he had started a new job working at a gentleman's club. When his shocked siblings asked if Peden was a male stripper, he laughed and assured them that he was a bouncer working security for the club. Once his family knew the Sister Wives cast member would be keeping his clothes on, they were very supportive of his new job. The father-son relationship is complicated because Cody and Peden are a lot alike. They both have big personalities, so it's no surprise that father and son butted heads. Tensions rose between the two men during the COVID-19 pandemic, during which Peden struggled to follow Cody's strict viral mitigation rules. The biggest issue between Cody and Peden is the fact that Peden hasn't always gotten along with Cody's favorite wife, Robin, and her children. Things got worse for father and son after Christine left Cody, and Peden took his mother's side. Cody hasn't reacted to Peden's job, but perhaps he'll do so during the rest of Sister Wives season 19. Christine Brown from Sister Wives marked one year with David Woolley by reflecting on the true love she has discovered, subtly taunting Cody Brown for never giving her unconditional love. Christine married Cody as his third wife in 1994, following Mary and Janelle Brown. Despite having six children together, Cody and Christine lacked the kind of romance she desired. Their relationship deteriorated further after Robin Brown joined the polygamist family as Cody's fourth wife. After feeling neglected for years, Christine finally ended her marriage. In late 2022, Christine met her soulmate, David, and they were married seven months later. Christine ended her marriage with Cody in November 2021. Nearly two years later, she married David in October 2023 and is delighted to have found love that surpasses her imagination. Christine shared a reel on Instagram featuring different romantic pictures of her and David with the caption, almost a year later, and I still feel like I won the lottery marrying David. In a subtle jab at Cody, who claimed that he was never attracted to Christine, the Sister Wives cast member expressed, every day, I'm reminded that love truly can be better than I ever imagined. Christine is more in love with David than ever. They not only did they have a strong romantic chemistry, but also seem to be each other's best friends. David refers to Christine as his unicorn, implying that she's unique and one of the most important people in his life. Sister Wives cast members such as Janelle and even viewers were initially worried about the quick pace of Christine and David's relationship. However, seeing how deeply in love they still are, it seems they made the right choice to get married just seven months after meeting each other. While Christine and David are going strong one year after getting married, it doesn't guarantee that their relationship will last long. There have been many red flags in their relationship which they would like to overlook. The couple has only known each other for two years and are likely to still have a lot to learn about each other's personalities. While David claims that Christine is the most important person in his life, he may have doubts when dealing with the family drama involving Cody and Robin, especially when it's all being aired on reality TV for everyone to see. Christine and David share a deep love and mutual respect. Despite potential challenges in their relationship, they've managed to prosper together. However, Christine's behavior on social media raises the question of whether she only married David as a way to validate herself to Cody, 
By constantly posting romantic pictures and presenting her relationship as perfect, Christine may be trying to mock Cody. Hopefully, Christine's wedding with David on TLC wasn't a power play, and she genuinely fell in love with his wonderful personality. Sister Wives fans would love to see Christine and David enjoy a long and happy life together. What do you think about this video? Please told on comment box also subscribe our channel. Thanks for watching this.